Okay, in this video, I'm going to talk about how to write an integral. This video leads on to uh, uh, leads directly on from my video of what is an integral and also what is a function. Now, if you don't know what a function is, or you think you do, I would suggest you look at my video because, I, like I said, this leads directly on from it, and uh, my other video might might help you. In actual fact, I'm going to link it onto this video. So we said a minute ago, sorry, we said in the video about a function that we might have y might have ingredients of it might have ingredients of x, z, and a, and that not you might they're all the ingredients. But you don't always use all the ingredients, so sometimes y might only be 2x, y might be uh, 6x plus a over 2, y might be uh, x, z, a. So this up here specifies the, func the, the variables or the ingredients, and these might specifically you know, tell you exactly how we're going to get y. Now, so like I said, this time, in general, y is a function of x at a. Here, y is only a function of uh, x. Here, y is a function of x and a. And here, y is a function function of x, z, a. All right. So, how first of all do you draw an integral? Well, the symbol is this. We said that before. That's the symbol for an integral. And you always put your function in there. So here's my function y. Okay. Now remember, y is a function of three different variables. And I might want to you. You can you can only integrate. Only integrate with one variable. Now look, that might seem a bit mad. And getting confused, but just just take that for fact. You can only integrate an, uh, one with one variable. Okay, so I can only add up all the x's or the z's or the a's. I can only get the area under the curve for the x-axis, the y-axis or the a-axis. Or I can only do um, the opposite of differentiation with respect to x. Now you may have heard different and that's fine, but for the moment we'll assume that you can only differentiate with respect to one variable. Now, with respect to means, right, you, you write this, we'll say dx means I'm going to integrate y with respect to x. So I'm only going to touch the x variables. You could have, I'm going to integrate y dz. You integrate y with respect to all the x variables. You might say dA. I'm going to integrate y with respect to dA. Another way of writing it would be y, um, uh, let me think now. So you might write y uh, equals, or we'll say y of y function of x, z, a, and I'm going to differentiate it dA. So I'm going to differentiate my function dA. We've seen that, we said that already, or dz, or you might want to integrate your function uh, dx. Now, but what do you see usually in school? Well, usually in school, as I've said before, you will only deal with y being a function of x. So therefore, it seems that every time you write an integral, you go, you go uh, I don't know, you might go y dx, or, you know, 2x dx, like that. Why 2x? Because that's y, because y is equal to a function of x. Okay? And uh, so y is a function of x, y is equal to 2x. That's what we have over there. And you're integrating it with respect to x. So the variable that you're going to integrate is x. So just be, be aware that this thing here can change. You could have lots of different things in there. It's not always dx. If you, if, what, if, what if I said this? What if I said x is a function of y? x is equal to 4y. And I want to integrate that function. So I integrate it. And I could say integrate x like that, dy because the, the, the variable is dy, that's the same as integrating um, that's the same as integrating 4y dy and that's the same as integrating uh, x a function of y dy. All those things mean the same thing. It means 
you're integrating dy and look there's three different ways of writing you can write x that's your function you could just write x but we know it's a function of other things you could write the function itself or you could say what it's a function of they all mean the same thing so that's how you write an integral now that's nice and short uh, if you have any comments uh, maybe you have a, um, a suggestions please write them on my video Thanks for watching, pass it on to your friends, I hope this is useful and please subscribe to my channel.